What is going on guys? We are here with episode 11 of our Pokemon Sword Let's Play. Last episode we made it to Holberry City or Holberry Town, whatever. And we are going to battle the gym. Or challenge the gym or whatever. Can you go this way? Oh, you cannot. But yeah, we just explored Holberry a little last episode, so I just kind of... He's still here! Hi there, thanks for rolling by to have a chat with your mate, the ball guy. I see you have a fishing rod. In that case, I've got the perfect Pokeball for you. Is it a net ball? A lure ball. Nope, that's not what I thought it was. I could have that you reel in with a rod while out fishing. If you manage to kill- What is he doing?! <laughs> if you manage to catch a Pokemon using your fishing rod, then it's time to use that lure ball. It's the absolute best Pokeball for people who like Pokemon that live in the water. Pokeballs are just full of surprises, don't you think? Oh my gosh. Uh, we'll be using... Actually, I will give him an item. If I can find them. I don't know if it's in this one. It's not in this one. It's not in this one. It's not in this one. Magnet. Do we have any TMs for? Oh, let's use magic. Sixty. Oh. Dark, dark, normal. Oh. Eh, I don't really want to use that for him. Wait. Just go to. Just go to the bag. Oh, it does have power. Wait, he can't learn it even though he has electric type moves. Whatever. Oh, yeah, let's definitely get rid of Razor Leaf. I thought it was just, like, the same, but it's better than Razor Leaf. But I think it's... Hold on. Go to Pokemon. I'm pretty sure Razor... Not Razor Leaf. Razor, Razor Leaf is physical. And I'm pretty sure Magical Leaf is special. Yeah. So what, what are his stats? Special is 39, attack is 48. So it might be the same. It might be the same. Because his special attack is almost 10 points lower than his regular attack. So I'm guessing he's more of a uh, physical attacking physical attacking Pokemon. <clears throat> okay, so they just said the same thing. Let's see. Okay, so the water uniform. Would that be... Yeah. Yes, I'm done shot. You, oh, you're a gym challenger. Okay. So. Yeah, I'm just gonna go ahead and battle the gym. Hey there, gym challenger. Shall we start the process to get you ready for the gym mission? That's right. You have to change into your uniform. The changing room is located over there. She looks so angry. <coughs> All right, you're in your uniform. Head on into the gym mission. Ah, oh, by the way, while you're on the gym mission, you can't use your Pokebox link or Pokemon box link, whatever. I want her uniform. Why can't I have that one? Why do I have to well wear this one that's like full ass t shirt and shorts? I want to show my belly. Oh, well, this looks interesting. Hoberry Pokemon Gym's mission is this, a challenging maze, and you must reach the goal to clear the mission. However, some paths in the maze are blocked by water. What should you do then? Try pressing that red button over there, and I imagine you'll figure it out, future champ. Now let the gym mission begin! Okay, so we can't go that way. So I'll have to go over here, battle this. I didn't switch. No, I'm not ready. That's okay. Time pole. Yeah, we should probably switch. Let's go with the wacky. 
But as soon as he reaches level 26, he won't obey me. Which is kind of upsetting. It looks yellow in here. What the heck? Hasn't he been like more of a light green? My speed. Yeah. Let's use magical leaf. We do have the miracle seed, which also boosts our our grass type moves. I love this music. Huh? Temple and I were the ones who got soaked? Yes, ma'am. Right, let me go ahead and switch. No hard feelings, Vulpix. Okay, so this is the only one we can go to. <laughs> so then, does it open that one? No. Anything open up? Okay, so this is the only other button we can go to. Oh, uh, I see now. Oh, the buttons are according to color. Okay, so what does this one do? Okay. So I'm guessing then once we beat this trainer, we'll press this yellow button, go down, press the red button. Yeah, I think. I think. Crabby. I noticed she had a uh, dive ball. I'm pretty sure that's what it was. Or what it's called. It's either dive ball or aqua ball or something like that. One hit knockout. <clears throat> Corefish. No. We are always going to keep in thwacky. This gym is so easy. <clears throat> I wasn't sure about the right thing to do in that battle. Well, you paid for it. So this one. Oh, okay. That's why I was worried because he got rid of two. I didn't know if it would do that. So it's a very linear battle, or linear gym. In order for you to progress, you have to do certain buttons in a certain order. So is this where that other one was blocked? Yeah. And we can't go through there. We don't have to battle her right now. So what does this button do? Oh, get me to the next button. Which is what we want. Well, we will have to battle her. I'm going to battle her. Whether we have to or not. So, oh. so I'm guessing this button. Don't battle me. Look away. Yeah. Okay. Wait, what? What? I'm just gonna battle her anyway. <laughs> what? You made it this far? And he wants to battle me? Maybe. Remember, that's such an ugly fish. But they're gonna live. That's gonna be like, huh, an actual opponent. So I'm thinking you can Dynamax any Pokemon. Right? Choodle. Oh, it's a little turtle! Wait, why don't I just use Choodle as a water type? I'm but I'm big dumb. Who wants to learn for Time Ball? No. 
That's where that move is. I thought it was facade. What is facade then? <coughs> okay. So we need to figure this out. So these control those two. So what's the button that controls that wait? We need the one that controls this one, so it's gonna be a red button. Is this one open next to us? Oh okay. That makes a lot more sense. Wait, okay, yeah, we can't go down. So we'll go down. There should be a red So it looks like we're gonna have to press this blue button and then the red button. So all the buttons control like each, like, I thought like say these are the only blue, that one and, and the one that just went away. Wait, why don't we just, well then. Okay, so we need that button activated, but then we need to get to another red button. But that's the only blue button we have. So why don't we just press this red button? This should work the way I want it to work. And then press this yellow button. Go this way. Press the red button and then yeah, this this should work. Okay, we got it. We got it. Make sure my Pokemon are in tip top shit. Just need one potion. For four for four HP points. Or hit points or whatever. Okay. Now we get to battle Nessa. Wrong button. Did not mean to do that. Gym mission cleared. Here we go. Her walk is so weird. Like, she keeps falling and... Okay, so what walking is is basically falling and catching yourself every step. Oh, well, she was doing it like she was falling. I was actually trying to catch herself with every step. Welcome, honored gym challenger. I think you already realized, but I'm Nessa. Sorry to have you. Sorry to have made you look for me. I don't doubt my humble mission's difficulty. Yet you cleared it. Your mind as a Pokemon trainer must be quite refined. No matter what kind of plan your refined mind may be plotting, my partner and I will be sure to sink it. The gym battle commence. I love the transition. It's, it's basically not even a transition. It's just, boom, you're in the battle. Hell yeah. We'll just use Magic Relief for now. I mean, yeah, that's the really... I really hope Dynamaxing is not a thing in VGC and Competitive. Like, I was okay with Mega Evolutions, because Mega Evolutions were cool. I have no idea what that Pokemon is, but stay in anyway, Thwacky. Kind of looks like a Barboach. He's too strong! Yeah, let's learn. Let's have Vulpix learn Willow Wisp. Let's get rid of the Whip. Ah, stay in. Looks like I'm down to one last Pokemon. I've been saving the best for last. <gasps> so the turtle evolves him too. I'm definitely switching him out for Time Pole.
Fill out the stadium and make it our ocean. Dreadnought, time to Dynamax. Shit. Love this music. Oh my god, I don't even need to Dynamax. Let's do it anyway. Because I want to. <laughs> he looks so cute still. <laughs> oh, I love him. Max Darkness. I feel like it would have killed me if I didn't Dynamax. That's also one reason why I did. That's okay, because he's about to die. It's super effective! I was on the screen. Good job, Thwacky. I may proudly be the strongest member of this gym, but I was totally washed away. How can this be? Now that it battles you, I think I understand. Continue to seize victories in the gym challenge with your Pokemon. You have an incredible spirit that may even be strong enough to challenge the champion. That's where you shake hands. You and your Pokemon are indeed deserving of this gym badge. His hand is like straight. To level 30. You want to challenge the fire gym leader next. As you and your Pokemon are now, he'll definitely want to battle you. Okay, so I'll probably switch out Toxel for the turtle thing. Code, my sincere congratulations for your victory over Gym Leader Nessa. Please take this commemorative TM. Whirlpool. So we did... Gr oh, so they do the three basic ones first. Grass, water, and fire. Nessa's uniform. Hell yeah! I'm excited. Don't know how to put it on, though. We'll do that later. Do not keep the chairman wait. Oh, I forgot about that. Do not keep the chairman waiting. Head to the seafood restaurant, the captain's table. So you will not forget the chairman's face. I will give you one of his league cards. One of? I've already got one. Chairman Rose is the kind of man who gets downhearted if he doesn't take care of things he needs to right away. Go to the seafood restaurant as soon as possible. So as not to keep the chairman waiting. Alright, so I'm gonna go to the Pokemon Center. Heal. Probably switch out that turtle for Pine Pool, because I forgot the turtle's name. Actually, let's check the Pokedex, because I want to see what type it is. Like if it's just. Is it just. Okay, so this is the final evolution. Is it just. Oh, it's water and rock! Okay. I really like to use, like, double uh, types double typed Pokemon so later in the game I can have those types at my hand so that way instead of oh, I didn't mean to go in here for yet damn it can I leave okay that way you have to like if every Pokemon is du double type you have 12 types instead of just one or instead of just six that's my way of playing I don't know how other people play but that that's just my personal way of playing Oh, I could just leave Adam to the party and have uh, Toxel stay in. Where is he? I know I have one. 
I know I have one. He's right here. Choodle. That's his name. Let's see, can we teach him that whirlpool whirlpool move? He can. Huh. Well, he's only level seven. Okay. We'll leave this place, save, and then go meet Chairman Rose at the captain's something. What is this place called? Oh my god, I want to read it. I want to read it! I won't let me read it. People are just standing outside. I want to say Captain's Deck, but I feel like that's wrong. Captain's Table. Welcome to the seafood restaurant. The Captain's Table. What is this? Oh, it doesn't tell me. Code, let's celebrate your recent victory. Oh, were you invited too? You two know each other? That's great. Come now. Please be seated. Holbury is a seafood town. Naturally, if one is going to eat here, the obvious choice is the local cuisine. Everything on the menu is delicious. By the way, how is Professor Magnolia getting on? I'm quite indebted to her, you know. She was the one who figured out how to unleash the power of Wishing Star and use that power to Dynamax Pokemon. We would never have been able to create Dynamax Bands without her. <sighs> she was saying that there's still so much we don't know about Dynamaxing. It's causing her some worry. She even made me take a Power Spot Detector with me when I started traveling. A Power Spot Detector? That's the device that allowed me to discover the Power Spots. Locations that emit Galar Particles and allow Pokemon to Dynamax. I don't like hearing that Professor Magnolia is so worried though. If only there was something I could do. Sonia, it may be good for you to visit the Vault in Hammerlock. I believe the key to unlocking the secrets of the Dynamax phenomenon lies in the history preserved there. Understood, Chairman. I will arrange a meeting with Miss Sonia. However, I believe it is about time we get going, Chairman. Mm, but I've hardly had the chance. I've hardly had a chance to speak with Code. It's regrettable, but I suppose it can't be helped. If something needs to get done, there's no time like the present, after all. In any case, I bid you all farewell. Well, that was a fast meeting. Does he think he's doing me a favor? He's right that the vault would be a good place to look in look for info on the legends, but You got the water badge, yeah? Defeating Ness is no small feat. Here's a team as a reward. Retaliate. Ooh. The first time I I saw that move was in black and white against a uh this lily pup into something into something. Stoutland. That's what it was. It was uh ends. This is a good friend. Perhaps I should drop in on her. Until next time, Jim Challenger. Don't even know my name? What kind of a woman are you? Alright, mate. We've both got the grass badge and the water badge by now, right? In that case, we're both headed for Motostoke and the Fire Gym Leader Kabu. How about I share with you a little tip about that Leader Kabu? From what I heard, he's holed up now in Galar Mine Number 2, undergoing some special training. If he's in there, then we can't take him take him on in Motostoke even if we zip right over there, putting the brakes on our gym challenge. So I say we head to Galar Mine number two ourselves. Let's go see what all the fuss is about. And that was my impression of a British accent. I hope I did not offend anyone, because that's not what I was trying to do. Because I know some people get offended, so just want to make sure I did not do that. I guess we can change or put Thwacky in a different spot now. Oh wait, I meant to, mm, I still kind of want to keep time pole just just in case there's a water poke or a poke that's weak to water and I might need him. Oh yeah, so I was gonna switch. <coughs> Level 20. Oh, this is good actually. Um, actually, I want to move Vulpix because we're going into a mine. So it's bound to be rock type of one. Oh, they're gone. Oh, they wouldn't have even let us go in there if we wanted to. I wonder if we get Ultra Balls now. Galar mine number two. <gasps> 
Is this from the Sinnoh region? It is. Dang. It's been a while since I've seen one of these. Oh, fuck. I was going to yawn. Oh, there we go. I think it's a ground type as well. Ooh. I like that animation. Not great. So it's got to be water and ground. I'm pretty sure. Okay, it's special. Should be able to catch it now. Inch power, okay. I should have seen if I could get some Ultra Balls. I regret it now. Nice. Pretty sure, I'm like 99% sure this is from the Sinnoh region. There's speculation that its appearance is determined by what it eats, but the truth remains elusive. Put it just into a box. And then Bar- not Barboach. Barnacle. Binnacle. Look at this cute little face. I don't remember what type it is either. Tweak to ground. And it was a crit. Damn. That's fine. Gives me a chance to catch you. I'm going to say this again. And I'm sorry. But the details in the Pokemon in the battle scenes look so damn good. They're so clean. There's barely any kind of misconfiguration. I just think it looks really good. I've said it once and I said it up and I've said it a thousand times. So rock and water, okay. It's into a box. Alright. Let me say Hmm, my Xbox doesn't seem to work. You again. I didn't heal. I feel s I feel sorry for my Pokemon if I made them take part in a battle against low-level opponents. I'm not in the mood to deal with weaklings right now. Then again, I suppose it's a form of mercy to crush weak opponents early on. If you're under the misguided impression that you're stronger than me, then surely you would be up for a Pokemon battle. Heh, <laughs> I have no time to deal with pathetic trainers. That's actually really cool, because I wanted to heal first. Um... But didn't we beat her last time? Okay, I've already read this. It's utterly inconceivable that I, the challenger chosen by the chairman, will lose. Pokemon trainer bead. Beady. Bede. Bede. Solosis. I really do like Solosis as a as a Pokemon. I have no idea what I was about to say. I didn't mean to do that. I like Bidet's battle music. Bead's battle music. <laughs> Looks like you've grown a bit. Only a little bit, though. Time pull. I'm going to need you to take a nap. That's okay. We'll switch to Thwacky. Our level 25. Yeah. Who has knockoff. And he's super effective. Easy.
off it. But... So it looks to me that she's a psychic type person. Damn. This shouldn't do much damage. I'm only grass type. Or he's only grass type. I'm a person. Oh, that was a crit? What you got next? What you got next? Let's go, Choodle. Hat. I forgot what Hatna was. We'll, we'll stay. Yeah, I'm pretty sure she just uses Psychic type. It's not every day I get to battle you, so I suppose I may as well try out this move. Siding? It's just a normal move. Let's go, Choodle! Ponyta. Okay, now we will switch. Not to Choodle, though. Ponytail. I was just going to quarter square. Excellent. Not everyone can corner my team like this. Oh, it's the. Oh, shit. Uh, I forgot what its type was. I should have known it was also psychic. Oh, we should be fine. Confusion. A B. I'm just kidding. Ah, uh, I'm funny. At least I think I am. Sometimes. You showed at least a little effort, so I decided I should let you win. She's just upset because she lost. <sighs> Pardon me. It seems I must take back my words. You're not weak, you just lack talent. Your chances of completing the gym challenge are pretty slim, I must say. Here, I'll give you this. Something to show you at least tried. Her league card. Now, where shall I go next to collect wishing stars? Is that that? Alright guys, whoa. This is where I'll be... I'm gonna pause, just right here. No. Yeah. All right, this is where I'm going to end the episode off. We battled the gym leader. We talked to Chairman Rose. We battled Bead. I think that's enough for one day. Um, if you like the video, be sure to leave a like down below. I really do appreciate it. It helps me so, so much. Uh, if, and if you want to see any more of my content, hit that subscribe button. We will keep doing the Pokemon Sword Let's Play daily. And then we will be doing Wi-Fi battles afterwards. So if you like the content, hit the subscribe button and notification bell. That way you will get notified when you when my videos go live. <laughs> anyway, I'll see you guys in the next episode.